This is a game of golf that you play with a standard deck of cards, just your regular old cards. It has nine different rounds before you total up to see which person is the winner. In this game, a jack and a queen both have a value of 10. An ace has a value of one. If you have double of a card, they cancel each out and make a zero. And if you have double kings, you get to subtract two points from your round. Person with the least amount of points at the end of all nine rounds is the winner. So you want the least amount of points in this game. We've got it set up over here. Each player gets four cards. They have no idea what those four cards are. They're placed face down. The rest of the cards get put in the middle and the top one gets flipped over for the next person to use. Before you start each round, you get to choose two of your cards, any two cards, to peek at just one time. So remember, when you're peeking, remember what your cards are. Two of them you know, two of them you don't. I dealt, so she's going to go next. She wants that ace because it's only one point. She knows what these two are, so she's going to replace it with something she doesn't know. Oof which was a good replace, less points. Ellie can decide to pick this up or this up. Four is kind of low point, so that's not a bad idea. She doesn't know what she's getting there. That was a good oh, replacement that too. Me. Ugh, a nine. That's a lot of points. I'm gonna choose to throw it out and flip over one that I know has low points. Oh. Quinn's turn. She probably doesn't want my nine. Oof, queen is a lot of points. I'm gonna flip over this thing. Whoa, lucky. Ellie's turn. Definitely don't want that. <laughs> Ten. Nice that flip. Ooh. Ooh, ace. I don't know what this is. I didn't peek at that one. Yay. Good replacement. Good replacement. Ten was too much. Your turn. Nope, your turn. My turn. Oh. <clears throat> I'm gonna take this one. Oh. I'm I know what this is, so I'm just gonna replace it. Same thing? Mm-hmm. Oh, zero lucky. Give me something good. I don't want a six. That's a lot of points. I don't know what this is, but it's kind of low points for a five. Oh! Now I get this too. And I think I might just keep this one because... Why did you decide to keep a seven because, even though this is a two? Because if you have the same of two numbers, they count as zero points. Doubles is worth zero. Go ahead, yeah. Ellie. So Ellie can take that two that Quinn threw out. I'm just gonna. She's gonna keep the ace that she had peeked at before. And I know what my card is because I peeked before and I know it's less than the two, so I'm gonna keep it. So we finished our first round. Our job is to total up how many points we have. This is where we're looking for friendly numbers that make 10 or doubles or doubles plus one in our game. I'll Go ahead and start total. adding up my points. So I know king's a zero, and together these two are zeros. So I just have one point. So she's going to add her one to the first round on our board. Ellie's going to total her points. So I know this is a zero, and these two are nine, and this is a 10. So I have 10 points. Nice. Nine and one more makes right, ten. ten down for Ellie. Perfect. And I know that five and one make six, but because I had double kings, I get to subtract out two. So I only have four points. Six minus two makes my four. So the first round is done. We put our points on the board. We would shuffle up our deck of cards deal out four more and keep going until nine rounds get played and then we would total up our whole column 
to see who has the least amount of points in the end. Let me know if you play. Have fun.